In this video, we are going to take a look at how to manage your organization's developers and consuming applications with Axway API Manager. Organizations can be either internal or external. Every organization is allowed to access a specific set of APIs. Those access rights are defined in the API Manager. Please note that this cloud trial environment doesn't allow you to create organizations. You are automatically enrolled as an organizational admin into a virtual organization. So as admin for every organization, you can create applications and developer profiles. Every enrolled developer can then access another tool called the API portal and manage their applications. In this demo, we will show how the enrolled developer manages the applications through the API portal. Let's get started. Let's create a new application. From the Clients menu, Applications submenu, click New Application to create the app. Let's call it Star Wars App. Then add an image. and a description. Let's now assign the APIs that the application is allowed to consume. I'll go ahead and select Star Wars API and Quote of the Day API. Click Create. And you'll see two new tabs, Authentication and Sharing. Because our Star Wars API is protected by an API key, I'll add an API key to the application by going to the Authentication tab and clicking on the New API Key button. You can see the new key in the API Key field, along with the secret key. Now, just click the Back button to save and finish the procedure. Since I'm not the developer who will work on the Star Wars app, I'd now like to enroll my colleague, Matt Jackson, as a developer. To do that, I go to the Application Developers submenu and create his profile. Click New User and add his avatar and login credentials, his login name, his email address. I'll assign him the role of user and create the new profile. After creating the profile, we can scroll down the page and click on the Reset Password button. This automatically creates a random password and sends it to Matt's email address, which gives him access to the API portal. For the demo purposes, we'll just assign a password directly by clicking on the Change Password button. Now, let's give Matt rights to the Star Wars app. If we go back to the app on the Application submenu, we go to the Sharing tab. In the drop-down, we can add Matt. When Matt receives the email, he can directly log into the API portal via the link in the registration email. Then, after login, Matt can see the Star Wars app as previously defined. He can also browse the API catalog by clicking the API tab. And it can test the Star Wars API, for example. Let's do a test with one of the methods. Awesome! Back on the Applications tab, Matt can click on the Star Wars app. He can now retrieve the API key, along with the secret key for reuse in his application code to build his own great app. Once the application is deployed and generating traffic, Matt will also be able to monitor that traffic on the Usage tab. 
Thanks for watching.